dear student welcome to the problem solving session on z transform part 3 in the first video we see the basic formula on z transform and then few properties and in the next video we started to solve simple problems on z transform in video number 4 we start solving problems based on first or frequency shifting property those who don't watch the videos go to the playlist watch all the four videos and come back here in today's session we are going to see the next property differentiation in z domain if z of fn is equal to capital f of z then what is the formula for z of n into f of n the answer is minus z d by d z of z of f of n or we can write this as minus z d by d z of capital f of z so we are going to see some problems based on this differentiation in z domain property now we are going to find z of n into a power n just a quick recap remember using first shifting property or frequency shifting property we solve the same problem just i am showing you we know that the formula of z of n so z of n into a power n is simply z of n using the shifting property z is replaced by z by a applying this and simplifying we will be getting z of a power n into n is a z divided by z minus a whole square now we are going to solve the same problem using this differentiation of z property so we know that z of n into f of n is equal to minus z into d by d z of z of f of n now we know the formula for z of a power n z divided by z minus a because we are going to use this property so z of n into f of n here in this case z of n into a power n so that's why we are writing the formula of z of a power n now applying the formula we get of n into a power n is nothing but minus z d by d z of z of a power n and we know our z of a power n substituting we get this expression next we are going to differentiate this expression so minus z we are going to apply u by v rule so my denominator is going to be z minus a whole square numerator is z minus a into differentiation of z is 1 minus z into z minus a differentiation is again 1 so minus z will be getting z minus a minus z divided by z minus a whole square now the z and z will get cancel we can see the type version z z get cancel multiplying minus z with minus a we will be getting a z divided by z minus a whole square therefore z of n into a power n is a z divided by z minus a whole square and next we are going to find the higher powers of n using this property we are going to find z of n square we know of n is nothing but z divided by z minus 1 whole square applying the property now z of n square will become minus z d by d z of z of n and we know the answer for z of n from the video 3 therefore i can write this as z by z minus 1 whole square now again we have to do the differentiation that is my u by v rule and we will get the answer minus z now in the denominator z minus 1 whole power 4 we know the rule d of u by v is equal to v square v du minus u dv now i am keeping z minus 1 whole square differentiation of z is 1 minus z into differentiation of z minus 1 whole square is 2 into z minus 1 now simplifying this will be getting z square minus 2z plus 1 on the other side minus 2z square plus 2z divided by z minus 1 whole power 4 now minus 2z plus 2z cancel simplifying this we will be having minus z square plus 1 now multiply the minus inside will be getting z into z square minus 1 by z minus 1 whole power 4 Now z square minus one is nothing but z minus one into z plus one. In the denominator we have z minus one whole power four. Now this z minus one will cancel with this. Therefore my final answer z of n square is nothing but z into z plus one. Divided by z minus one whole cube. This is my answer. Similarly, one can find z of n cube. Next problem: 
we are going to deal with z of n cube as i said it can be written as n into n square and we know that z of n square is z into z plus 1 divided by z minus 1 whole cube just now we found in the previous question now applying the rule we can get z of n cube is minus z d by d z of z of n square and now using u by v rule i can find the solution very easily so i just left this problem for your practice you can do by yourself and i am displaying the final solution that is z of n cube is nothing but z into z square plus 4 z plus 1 divided by z minus 1 whole power 4 next they can ask z of n c 2 what is n c 2 do you remember our basic combinatorics which was studied in a school days n c 2 is nothing but n into n minus 1 by 2 so 1 by 2 n square minus n this is going to be very easy because we know z of n is z by z minus 1 whole square and just now we found z of n square that is that is z into z plus 1 divided by z minus 1 whole cube now using these two formulas and this result we can be able to find the value of z of n c 2 just apply z transform on n c 2 we will be getting 1 by 2 1 by 2 z of n square minus 1 by 2 z of n so just take lcm for this two formula we will achieve the answer so 1 by 2 z minus 1 whole cube z into z plus 1 minus z into z minus 1 now taking z in common will be getting z plus 1 minus z plus 1 simplifying this z z will get cancel will be getting z by 2 times z minus 1 whole cube again 2 2 will get cancel therefore z of n c 2 is z of n c 2 is going to be z by z minus 1 whole cube next problem sometime they can ask find z of 1 by n into n plus 1 so we use partial fraction we don't use any property here we are going to use partial fraction to split the problem and we know the formula for z of 1 by n and z of 1 by n plus 1 it's very simple so i'm just going little quick now taking lcm we will be getting a into n plus 1 plus b into n now it is easy to see put n equal to 0 we will be getting a value directly a into 1 is equal to 1 and put n equal to minus 1 to tackle this problem we will be getting b equal to minus 1 substituting a and b value will be getting this now applying z transform on both sides and we know the formula of z of 1 by n that is nothing but log z by z minus 1 minus z of 1 by n plus 1 is z into log z by z minus 1 now taking log z z minus 1 in common we will be getting 1 minus z log z by z minus 1 hope you got idea how to apply the formula z of n into f of n in this video thanks for watching subscribe to our channel and share to your friends see you in the next video bye bye